Okay, grocery haul for this week. I actually went to Waitrose, first time venturing into a supermarket with Miles, and he was asleep pretty much the whole time um, until we got to right at the end. But I did the scan and go, which means that you scan it and you pack everything yourself and just pay at the end, which is so much easier. Um, yeah, so I spent £57, got £10 off because I had a voucher, and then I ended up getting another £11.80 off because I put um, a few lottery tickets through that needed to be done. So yeah, it's quite a cheap shop generally, um, have, getting the discounts off and vouchers that I had. Um, yeah, so I'll show you what I got anyway. I actually managed to use my Veggio bags as well, which is always good just to help. These are Veggio. I'll try and leave them linked in the description bar. You can get similar ones from Amazon, but this is the company here, Caronet. Uh, they do them all different sizes. Um, really fancy sprouts like roasted sprouts with like bacon oh my god that just sounds amazing so i got some sprouts i got some broccoli i got carrots and i got onions some cavillo nero it's basically like a dark cabbage um some cucumber baby leaf salad this is like a duo pack some peppers potatoes and um spring greens which are mainly i mainly give this to the rabbits and it's like 80p so it's quite cheap but it's a good green for them um, and then obviously the rest of our veg and fruit will come from the farmer's market and our local green grocer down the road um, I got some chicken drumsticks which are 25% off me and Graham are going to have these for lunch I got some decaffeinated coffee just the instant stuff for me no added sugar tomato oh sugar I didn't realize I got the tomato and chili oh well we'll give it a go it's only one pounds five p and then I got the bolognese as well um, these are just quick pantry staples. Two garlic baguettes, one will go in the freezer and one's going to be for this week for a meal. Some rich tea biscuits, Graham loves those, we all love those with a cup of tea. And then two for two pounds on the Alpro, these are the ones in the fridge. So uh, hazelnut and the coconut almond, haven't had these in ages so I thought I'd go for those. Cheese strings were two for two pounds. And then I got the chocolate biscuit selection. I'm going to try and put these away for Christmas but these were 26 biscuits for three pounds. Not the best value I've seen around, but the Waitrose biscuits are really good. Um, I got the bagel thins, the seeded ones. They're definitely my favourite, actually. Other than the cinnamon raisin, the seeded are really, really nice. And then I got some um, shreddies and frosties for cereal. Also some brioche. Usually the kids have, like, for a quick breakfast at the moment, they usually have, like, a cereal and then have a slice of brioche. That's kind of their go-to at the moment. Kind of a bit high sugar, but... Um, it's just easy at the moment for them just to be quite independent. Um, and then I got some, as a switch up, instead of sandwiches or wraps, I got the Warburton's Thins. They used to have these a lot. And actually, I really like these as well. So I got those. I got some of my favourite hummus. I haven't had that in ages. Uh, the kids chose the Krispies. So they, these are their, their ultimate favourite go-to at the moment. Cheese and onion baked walkers. And then the Sun Bite Sweet Chili. Graham also likes both of them. Then these were on offer, so I got the touch of caramel dark and then the touch of mint or the mint intense dark as well for chocolate. And then randomly I put the fresh stuff over here. So I got two of the cod fish cakes in there. And then me and Graham have got the salmon on fruit. These were actually two for five pounds. We've had them before, they're really, really nice. It's just freshly made and you just pop them in the oven and the pastry just goes all puffy. So we've got that as a fish night this week and then also I'm going to do a roast chicken. This one is the pork and onion stuffing inside. Um, it's just one of those ones that kind of roast in the bag. So that is my Waitrose haul. But also beforehand, I was in the area of co-op. We have a co-op locally. And sometimes for snacks, it's actually a lot cheaper. Um, especially if they have deals on then Waitrose. So I picked up a couple of things. I picked some apple bars. I really like these as well as the kids. And then we also got the six pockets, six pocket packs of three cakes. So these are just little Jaffa cakes on the go. Uh, they were both a pound each, by the way. And then I got two for two pounds on the rice, the Mexican style and the savory chicken. Just again, pantry staple. And then the suckies were two for a pound. No, two for... Yeah, two for a pound, so 50p each, which usually, originally, they're 75p each. So I've got strawberry, peach. I've got some Ritz crackers. We haven't had them in years, but I randomly saw those for a pound. And then also these were on offer. 
the salt and vinegar and the original Pringle. Okay, so this is the fruit and veg box from the farmer's market and then this is from the green grocer which is local. Um, we're getting a lot of the same stuff so I think we might end up ditching this one because we just end up with so much and it's just a bit of, yeah, it's pretty much the same. So we've got bananas, pears, we've got some oranges, some plums and some apples, which is pretty much what we have over here as well. We've got plums there, apples, pears, oranges, bananas, and then we've got some of these little peppers. Um, they're really cool. Cucumber, two lots of blueberries. We've got some parsnips. Oh, I haven't had those in ages. Some of these bunch carrots, which are really nice. The rabbits absolutely love the stalks. Um, mini peppers, which are nice, like the sweet ones. And then we've got some cherry tomatoes, some mushrooms. We've got some dates because it is getting to that sort of Christmassy date season. Um, so they're like the big juicy medjool dates. And then we've got some grapes, which kind of look a little bit iffy. But um, yeah, that is pretty much fruit and veggie boxes for this week okay and for meal plan this week so on monday today is actually wednesday uh monday we had toad in the hole with onion gravy and some veg yesterday i did like a full-on roast chicken um with like roast potatoes roasted sprouts with bacon we had carrots and we had broccoli and then like a chicken gravy tonight we're gonna have a fish night we're gonna have those salmon on croutes um violet's actually at a friend's house so alice is gonna have the cod cake with mashed potato and some of the dark uh, cabbage. And then tomorrow I am doing, what am I doing tomorrow? Do you really trying to remember? Oh yeah, the mushroom risotto, which is the Deliciously Ella recipe, which is on the app. I haven't done it before, but it looks really, really good. So we're having that and it's gonna be a meat-free dish. Definitely, I'm just gonna put loads and loads of mushrooms in because I have a ton anyway. And then on Friday, we usually would have like a pizza night or something like that, but I'm actually gonna do spaghetti bolognese because I've got the mints in the fridge um, and it's just every, one of everyone's favorites and I'm gonna serve it with some garlic bread. So yeah, that is our meal plan for this week. Again, I really hope you enjoyed this video. Let me know if you have, and don't forget to check out my recipe playlist, which is in the description bar. It's like right at the bottom. Um, which I have all my uh, old school recipes that I use like you know from time to time and even some of that Christmassy baking ones which would be quite good now so um, yeah I hope you have a good week and I will see you all soon